Hello everybody, this is Nick. And Matthew from Plastic Tombstone. And we're back with another episode of PT's Toy Box. Where we take an honest look at toys and collectibles. Today it's a Loot Crate Animation. That's what the title is. It's got Turtles, Rick and Morty, Bob's Burgers, and Futurama. So Only one of those things I actually like. I started watching Rick and Morty. It's not bad. It's a little I've heard weird. It's pretty funny. I've never. I've it's never a, been it's to watch it. it's a little weird. It's a little out there, but it's. I think you might like it. You should check it out. I probably will. So let's see what we got. Well, right out the gate, the shirt is looks like a turtle shirt. Turtle shirt. I don't have enough of these. I don't think. It's a different shirt. It's got a little shell pattern. Hmm. A little outline of the turtle van. Old school turtle uh. style. So this is the front of a shirt, right? Yep. It's kind of weird that the turtle shell is on the front. Yeah, it wouldn't make sense for it to be on the back, right? Nothing you, on you the think, back. You think it would be like the front of the shell here. This is like the back of their shell. It's a little odd. Yeah. Odd design choice, but still a nice nice shirt, I guess. And it's green. And it's a loot, it's a loot wear exclusive. Loot wear exclusive. This is the Rick and Morty thing. It's a figure, and it looks like it's... Who makes that figure? Does it have a... I don't know. Huh. I guess it's just a loot crate figure. And it has explicit content, which is probably means he's flipping somebody off. So we might probably not blur it out, but we're... Yep. <laughs> so this is Rick from one of the episodes entitled Peace Among Worlds Season 2 Episode 6, and he's given the double birds. That's great. That's, <laughs> that's probably the best thing I've ever seen in a loot crate. I don't you know. We watch this show, and it's a guy flipping double birds and looking insane. It's it's it. not a bad show. It, it's a little out there, but some of the stuff's really funny. So, All right. um, this is a Bob's Burger Burger, burger box. box. So this is the Bob's Burger Burger Box. Real recipes for joke burgers. So on Bob's Burgers, sort of like on The Simpsons, you know how the chalkboard changes every. Well, he has recipes, uh, different recipe pun name burgers. This one's New Baconings, uh, Pablo Picasso Burger. And these are just recipes to make the actual burgers that are in the show. Oh. Pickle My Funny Bone Burger. And the backs have little Bob's Burgers. Bob's art. Burgers art yeah. on it. Yeah. This is kind of cool. It's an interesting thing. I, I mean, I never would have thought to get something like that. Uh-oh. Capoeira. He's a capoeira teacher. Hmm. But yeah, bet it all on black garlic burger, and then that's it just bad. shows you how to make it. It's kind of a cool concept. Yeah. And if you're a fan of Bob's Burgers, which I am, it's it's sort of inside. Plus poutine on the Ritz burger. Plus, who doesn't like burger recipes? Yeah. Here you go. You ready for the best item of the box? <laughs> I saw it already. There it is. Keeping up with loot crates. We need drinkware. We got a slurm koozie from Futurama. I would have liked. I mean, the Rick and Morty figure is pretty cool, but it would have been cool to get like a Futurama figure. But here you go. Oh, you can have one of these. It's a two pack. Oh, well, you can keep that. I don't watch Futurama. <laughs> and then the pen is a Gene in the Burger outfit from Bob's Burgers. So with this box, you get Ninja Turtles shirt, a Rick and Morty exclusive Rick flipping people off figure. A Bob's Burger Burger Box recipe book. Essentially a recipe book for different kinds of burgers. Yeah. And two slurm koozies. Favorite out of the box? I'm gonna go with this. I don't watch the show, but I love anything offensive, so. <laughs> there you go. The figures, it, it's a nicely made figure too. Yeah, and it's, it's, it's not well like done. it doesn't feel cheap or anything else. And it looks like it popped right out of the show. And if you're a big Rick and Morty fan, then this is definitely something you're going to want. I wonder... They could be really hit or miss. I, I know a lot of kids order these. I wonder if this is going to be a problem. I think it's because of the... They, that's why they put that explicit thing on the box. But yeah, you never yeah, know. I mean, still... It's not a kid's show. I know it's... It kind of disguises itself as a kid's show. We know, show we, know there's, we open a crate, the, the gamer block, you know? Yeah, and it's aimed for mature and need for everyone. One. Yeah, this one is like... This one's some, I, I can see some complaints coming from this. Yeah, maybe. But uh, they had a they had a solid gold one at, at Comic Con. <laughs> Same thing, just solid gold for some reason. What's so, your what's your favorite item? Uh, I don't know. I, I think I like this just because it's something different, you know, the Bob's Burgers burger recipe things. Because I, I remember the episodes they're from and everything else, and I'm a I'm a big fan of the show, which is why 
I'm a big fan of all the shows. I mean, I just started watching Rick and Morty, but I watch all the other shows. So that's why we did the Loot Crate DX. I'm a little hesitant on it because Loot Crate DX can kind of be. Last time I got a blanket and a bookmark and a paperweight, all in the same box. So I don't remember that. That's terrible. So we'll see, we'll see how it goes. Tune in next time when we are eating some gourmet burgers that Nick made. Anyway, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and all that good stuff. Check us out on all social media and let us know what you thought of this Loot Crate box. And until next time, <laughs> that's what you're going to say.